I gave everything to my girlfriend, but she burned all my money to party with her just friend. Now her life is about to change drastically. Imagine, if you will, that your boyfriend and parents have financially supported you for the last two years. While you're at school, the love of your life is out working 50 hours weeks. While you are doing shots with friends instead of studying, your 63-year-old parents work second jobs to pay for your apartment. While you're out doing molly and spending the money your parents gave you for books and concert tickets. For you and the guy who is just a friend, your dad nearly has a stroke from the stress. And while you're out poop talking, your boyfriend because he has the nerve to cry in front of you, boyfriend is mourning the loss of his brother. If this sounds like you, well, congratulations. Your life is about to change drastically. Let me inform you of what will happen today. I'll be long gone at noon when you decide to roll out of bed, you will never see me again. You may need clarification. Simply locate the envelope on the counter which will contain all the text logs of you mocking me while I mourned my brother's death along with the nudes that you and your just a friend were sharing. Under those will be the bills I've been ignoring. The water and electricity will both be shut off next week. A reminder that they're in your name, so I can look into that. Also included is the email I have sent to all the professors of classes you cheated in last semester, along with the write-up and evidence I sent to the academic committee that oversees student dishonesty. You may be worried about attending uni next semester. Don't worry. Because the account you used to fund that was emptied yesterday. Now, what should you do now that I'm gone? Seeing as I've been responsible for everything up until now, your first instinct may be to call daddy. I recommend against that. At 1030, an automated text will be delivered from me to your mom and dad, informing them of how you've been spending the money they give you. At this point, you may still be thinking you can slither your way out of this. Don't worry. The texts of you drunkenly confessing to being the one who broke into your grandmother's house hours after she was rushed to the hospital to steal the jewelry will also be sent to every single family member's number. I have access too. You may be worried, upset, concerned, and many other feelings. A woman's life is about to crash down on top of her would feel you should. Your life is about to get a whole lot harder, starting today.